Inside the furnace room of an industrial building in northeast Calgary is a black shiny appliance the size of two refrigerators. Open the latch to see inside and it's filled with a white powder resembling flour. The device actually converts CO2 emissions from the boiler and furnace to create a type of potash. A plumber by trade, Jason Cardiff, has spent the last 15 years developing the technology. If you want to use natural gas as a form of heat or energy for your building, you have to have some sort of device to reduce the emissions. The potash from the machines can be used for the agricultural and pharmaceutical industries. It can also be used to make soaps and detergents. So far so good. We've had no issues with it at all. It's a really functioning bar of soap, so it does what it's supposed to do. As the world focuses on reducing greenhouse gases, often that means cutting the use of fossil fuels. For natural gas companies, they see innovations like this as a way of ensuring they have a future in a world focused on low emissions. NACO wants to reduce the carbon emissions from its own operations, but ultimately help our customers reduce their emissions. And so we're, we're promoting it and, and we're hoping that customers as well will, will start to use this technology. Clino 2 has about a dozen of its units operating in Alberta and BC. The company wants to grow that number to more than a thousand industrial buildings like this by the end of next year. Kyle Bax, CBC News, Calgary.